Police are investigating a brutal assault caught on camera inside an elevator in Chelsea. Investigators say a construction manager punched a 60-year-old man in the face. Yeah, you can see it was two quick punches, and it left the victim slumped on the floor, seemingly unconscious. Eyewitness News reporter Michelle Charlesworth spoke exclusively to the victim's wife, who says his life is never going to be the same. You can lose your life in a moment. This brutal attack on February 2nd of a disabled 60-year-old stroke survivor is at the heart of this case, according to attorneys. This is Richard Regan's elevator in his apartment building where he was attacked, punched twice in the head until he fell unconscious. Caban attacked Regan completely unprovoked, punching him twice in the head before fleeing the scene as Regan laid bleeding unconscious in the elevator. The Regans have lived here on West 23rd Street for 25 years. They've lived in that apartment that long, and they've always felt safe. Mr. Regan was terribly injured, spent eight days in the hospital, treated for bleeding on the brain, in terrible pain, suffering seizures, and then had to undergo brain surgery. It's been two months in all. The man seen punching the 60-year-old is police say 48-year-old Andrew Caban. He has pleaded not guilty. His attorney says, quote, the video of this incident did not record their verbal interaction and does not accurately capture what occurred. Ms. Regan says her husband simply remarked that it had taken a long time for the elevator to come. It stopped and went silent. And so I thought, oh, he realized that my husband's disabled and he just, you know, backed off. But no, he was unconscious, that's why it was quiet. The attorneys for Richard Regan are going after the alleged assailant, the construction company he worked for in the apartment building, as well as the management company. There was no exchange of angry words. Mr. Regan simply indicated he had to get somewhere. The couple's attorneys say there are no words that explain this brutal attack. He was just humiliated and violated and nearly killed. Lily Regan says the worst part is this happened at home and that there's nothing that can make this right.